All right guys, Cody with Irie AT here coming at you with another tip for the Tactile Graphics Toolbox. So we've shown you how to create formula generated equations and graphs manually using TactileView, but what if we want to do something automatically or on the fly? Uh, what if we want to just be able to copy and paste our equation right into TactileView and then also convert that into a graph as well? Well, we're gonna show you how to do all that using a piece of software called MathType. So why don't you check out the video and let us know what you think. Welcome to Irie AT, Braille and Innovation. First things first, of course, you're going to want to have both the math type software and the tactile view software installed on your PC. So as you can see, I have tactile view opened up right here. I'm going to go ahead and minimize this and open up math type to show you how we get started. You'll notice when I pull up math type, we have a few different symbols up above that we can choose from by clicking on. Um, but I prefer to enter my equation below manually. So we're going to go with y equals 4x plus, let's go with 2. Okay. Now we're going to highlight it. I'll highlight the equation by clicking and dragging my mouse. And I'm going to right click and select copy. Then we're going to hop back over to tactile view we're going to select the text label tool. And when I select the text label, we get a bit of a submenu directly to the right of it, which has a few different options for the type of text label. The first option is your computer keyboard input or QWERTY. Your second option is your braille keyboard input or six key. And your third option is your math input. And that's the option we're going to select. So I'm going to select this icon, and then you'll notice that my cursor has a little text label icon next to it, indicating that I can place a text label anywhere I click on the canvas. And so once I click, you'll notice we get this Add Mathematical Equation dialog box. And one thing to note here, guys, is that depending on two different things, this dialog box might look a bit different on your version of TactileView. The first thing is that if you don't have MathType installed on your PC, you may not have this Paste Math Equation from Clipboard option available. The second reason would be due to the version of TactileView that you're running on your PC. So just make note of that and just be aware. You'll notice in here though that we have a few different things to choose from. We have the ability to select our mathematical notation as well as a few other options. So what we're going to first do is we're going to paste our equation and we're going to select the paste math equation from clipboard button. And by doing this, you'll notice that it pastes in our equation in a few different formats or representations. The first option is your text representation. Your second option is your spatial representation. And the third, of course, is your braille representation. You'll also notice that there is a plot equation as grid checkbox or grid or graph is what they refer to graphs in tactile view. So I'm going to go ahead and check this and what it's going to do is it's going to actually allow us to not only display the equation in Nemeth, it will also graph the equation for us. I'm going to go ahead and hit OK and bam, there you go. We not only have our equation, we also have a graph of our equation. Let me make that a little bit bigger for you zoom in on the equation up here and you'll notice that we have a text representation of the equation so we're going to go ahead and highlight the equation select display spatial representation and there you go you'll notice it is listed in green on there indicating that it's going to be in print and of course it won't be embossed hey guys thanks for watching our videos on how to create equations and graphs using math type and tactile view Check out our next video on how to edit those graphs and many upcoming videos coming soon.